Welcome back guys, um, so this is going to be the part of the video, as I said before, that will be presents from other people. Um, so yeah, first of all, thank you very much to our parents, because um, this is going to be presents from our parents, uh, and my dad's girlfriend Mandy. Billy's dad got uh, got me this Sugar Skull set. I don't know why he got me it, because Ellie's going to steal it, that's why. But yeah, so he got a big notebook like that. Um, rubber, sharpener and pencil which are gorgeous but yes I might as well give them to Ellie as she is going to steal them <laughs> <laughs> um, these are awesome that he got me these are absolutely incredible he knows that I'm starting to do my writing uh, he wanted to get me something to help with that um, asked me before Christmas if I wrote in journals and things um, and I hadn't done because I did most of the stuff on computers up till now but I've actually found over the Christmas period um, he got me a pack of pencils with it because you can rub out pencils, so they're good for putting down ideas. Um, I had one of these books and I started in them, and actually it's been invaluable for me planning out my current story, doing character profiles, sketching little things out and stuff. It's been brilliant. Uh, so yeah, so these little journals, just ring-bound, plain paper stuff, but on the front of them are photos from our wedding and quotes from writers like Alan Gins, uh, Ginsberg and um, George Orwell um, that are inspiring. So these are absolutely gorgeous because it means that when I start a new one I've got an amazing picture to look at and every time I close it, it makes me smile. So these are really thoughtful and I absolutely love them and I'm sure I will be getting a lot of use out of them. And then he also got us some like chocolates and um, yeah. Um, We've been really, really lucky. Really the lucky. fact we got anything from him is we're so thankful. So, um, my dad got me. I like pajamas. I live in pajamas when I'm not at work. He got me fluffy socks. And again with the nail theme, like a little, a little thing of loads of different nail art. Nail art things. There's dice and stars and moons and all sorts in there. Um. He doesn't really approve of my piercings, so... I think it was more so you could put them all on at once and go into work. And terrify them, probably, yeah. yeah. Um, and then, because what 26-year-old doesn't enjoy loom bands? <laughs> so he got that, he opened it, and I was sitting there thinking, that's a bit of a weird present. But I did do it. But then it got to the afternoon of Christmas, and we're all sat there trying to understand the instructions that are meant for five-year-olds... <laughs> So I use good old YouTube. And you love them now. I do. Yeah. I do loads of them. So that was a good present. And these are my two favourite presents, probably of Christmas, other than my handbag. He got me, it's hard to see, a little octopus necklace. But he's wearing a crown, and the crown's separate. But he's so cool. And he got me, they're not matching earrings, but they are octopuses with crowns on. And they're tiny little pink octopuses holding little blue anchors. See how close you can get it up there. With little crowns on. Yeah, they're really so cute. So cute. I can only wear one at a time. But well, it means that one doesn't get damaged. Yeah, they're so, so cool. So cool. And he got Milo stuff, didn't he? Snackums. Or schmackos. <laughs> which he now wants me to give him and he's not getting. Oh well, dear. So, next. That's it from my dad. Yeah? Yeah. Right, so next we got from my dad. Um, he's big into crystals and things now um, and he got us these slices of it's not a gate is it? I think it is is it a gate? we're not very um, good but we got a slice each and they're twins they go together yeah so that's really thoughtful um, and then the big thing he got us was this bad boy I don't know if people are going to pick up the colours it's amethyst geode um on a stand, huge piece. Ooh. Um, I don't know if you can pick up the yeah, colours. You pick up the colours on it now. It's stunning, and it means that if we get burgled, we can kill the guy. <laughs> <laughs> but no, it's it's really really pretty, and um, I love. I'm I'm not huge into crystals for the um, uh, the hippie stuff. I don't, it's not really fair to call it hippie, but you know what I mean. Uh, the, the energy For stuff. For their prophecies, you like them because they're pretty. I really love them when they're in their raw state like this and they haven't been polished. I mean, these bits have been polished, but 
I just find them really tactile and they're always nice and cold and yeah. It's a weirdo. Um we got some festival printed toilet roll. Because we do regularly steal toilet roll from him. <laughs> yeah. Um he got me a Lynx Ooh, I'm not gonna be able to pick that up. No, you don't eat it, cat. Lynx Golden Dark Temptation set. Um which has in it two um, sprays and a shower gel. And most of the Link stuff I've tried I like anyway. So, um, And then lastly, he got me four canvases. Three new brushes. Really nice. Nice, nice brushes. And two sets of acrylic paints. Um... Which are awesome. You go through them really quickly. I go through pretty, pretty quickly. So I'm going to be using them. I've already got plans for these four canvases. So watch this space. Um, so yeah, thank you so much for them, Dad. And uh, I love all of them. They're brilliant. Mark's dad's got me. Tia Maria. Because his girlfriend's introduced me to, to Tia Maria with coffee. So that's why I get them. The fluffiest owl that ever did live. Looks so demented. Lots of our presents are around octopus themed, and that's my fault. And I apologise. Pirate socks. There is a pirate theme. Uh, my dad, for some reason, associated our wedding venue with pirates, so he played along with the joke um, that he would dress as a pirate in full pirate outfit for our wedding. So it's been an ongoing joke. He ended up getting a pirate birthday party, so ha ha. <laughs> um, he got me this really, really nice... I don't know what it is. It's like a purple a purple stone bracelet. More nail tattoo things. An owl money purse. And a hair bow. So thank you, thank you. Oh, actually, I forgot the main thing. Taffy, don't eat my owl. <laughs> and this is the main present, and it's amazing. It's a, um, I don't know how to describe it, it's not watercolour, it's like a, I don't know, I don't know how to describe it, but it's a Rottweiler. Yeah, it's, it's like, um, I think it's digital art. But it's amazing. I think it's been printed, I think someone's done it on a computer, and then printed it on there. Um, but it's done. It's a um, the artist's got a card in the back of there and it's signed and stuff because they're um, rare pieces. But yeah, if you can see that, I don't know. How gorgeous is that? It's stunning. And while we're doing pictures, um, one of my best friends, I told her not to get us anything because they all had to travel to Cornwall for our wedding, which is, I don't know, over four hours for most of our friends. But she got me... Owl. It's a burrowing owl wearing a top hat and a monocle saying, frankly, my dear, I don't give a hoot. And owl bath bombs. She's so naughty. <laughs> Thank you, Nat. Andy um, is probably the most imaginative person we know with presents. So she got me this. Well, I love drawers and boxes. She got me this chest of drawers. But in it is like really memorable, thoughtful things. So Things from the wedding. So, um, this is all the wax from the altar we had at our wedding. And um, the stickers that I put on people's presents. And we had butterflies um, like dotted around because they're a symbol of everlasting life. And um, she's one of the butterflies. Chocolate, which I hadn't eaten, which I will eat now. Maybe I'll eat the chocolate when you talk about things. And we had, um, it's like a mixture of the stuff that was in the bottom of our vases. So there's a bit of um, gems, gems and, and stuff. And then Tony, Mark's mum, who passed away um, two years ago, collected hat pins. And Tony gave me one of her purple hat pins, which I don't really know what to do with yet, but I'm sure... Sorry, the cat's still eating my owl. Um, I'm sure something will come to me. So I've never known anyone as imaginative with, like... She doesn't wrap stuff. She puts it... Yeah. We've got awesome. shot glasses which came in a little wicker hamper. Mm. <laughs> it's just amazing that she doesn't, she doesn't wrap stuff. She does other things. And then finally, finally, Mandy's present for me 
which he was like a little child with me opening it, so absolutely chomping at the bit, and now I know why, is a giant terracotta skull. <laughs> Look at it. How awesome is that? It's my size of my head. But bring your head in. Oh. We don't know whether you're going to paint it or... Uh, I think what I want to do with it is I want to paint it with chalkboard paint. I don't know if you know about this. But, um, you paint it on and then it goes like a chalkboard. You can um, you can um, write on it in chalk so then I can have different designs on it. Anytime. And you get coloured chalk. So then I can just make it Day of the Dead and it can change it. It's not going outside. No, no way. But yeah, I don't know what we're going to do with it yet. But from the looks of it, we are... You'll see in our wedding hall video when we eventually get around to doing it. We're basically building on the top of one of our bookcases a um, a Day of the Dead altar. Um, unintentionally, but we love it. Um, and after seeing the Book of Life movie, kind of a bit more cemented now. It's amazing. Um, so yeah, those are all of our presents. Um, we can't get over how generous people have been. The wedding blew us away. People's gifts at the wedding blew us away. That was our Christmas. We weren't expecting anything. Really, it's been so long. I guess it's because all the presents are so thoughtful that they, yeah. they mean loads to us. Um, so cheers for watching, guys. Thank you for all the comments on the previous videos um, and watching them. We're surprised at how much of um, a response we've got so quickly. Um, so, yeah, cheers for watching, guys, and we shall see you in the new year, probably. Bye! Bye. Literally, like, suckling you.